Hi everyone, so I wanted to do a Retainers 101 video. I got a request on my middle school makeup video that somebody wanted me to do a video on retainers. So I got my braces off when I was 14 years old and I'm 22 now, so eight years, crazy. And I have strictly worn my retainer every night. And I promise you, you know, maybe I miss like a couple days out of, you know, eight years, but my teeth have not moved at all. And I was supposed to wear my retainer more frequently before I got my wisdom teeth out. I got my wisdom teeth out when I was 18 years old. And honestly, I didn't. I only really wore them to go to sleep and nothing happened, my teeth didn't move. Once I got my wisdom teeth out, my orthodontist said, yeah, you should just, you know, wear it to go to sleep, which I did. I still have pretty straight teeth. You know, nothing has moved. My retainer fits perfectly and yeah. The case for my retainer recently broke and it lasted a long time, you know, eight years for a retainer case and it suddenly broke, you know, it happens. So I went on Amazon and for, I think it was like $9, I got two cases and they're super cute and glittery and girly. This retainer case has holes. I know some people say that they don't want breathing holes in it. I just went the same route as my other one. My orthodontist gave me one with holes, so yeah, that's what I did. I don't have a permanent retainer on the bottom. I don't have like the Invisalign ty type of retainer. I don't have like the clear retainer. I have the more of the old fashioned one. You can see it. I pretty much, I wash it before putting it in my mouth. I wash it after taking it off in the morning. And that's been good enough. This is what I put it on. Yeah. I still have a lisp when I wear them. <laughs> I guess I don't really practice talking with them on. When I take them off, I don't yank them out of my mouth. I softly take them out yeah um, they're not tight at all they've never really been tight it was just you know form-fitting they were, they still fit perfectly luckily because I don't know what I'd do if I had to have braces again I had braces for oh my god it was like three years I got them off right before my 15th birthday I was so happy it was one of the best days of my life <laughs> just to like have my tongue glide over my teeth it was just a surreal feeling and just being able to eat everything and not i was super meticulous when it came to my braces i would floss all the time and i was very nitpicky after i ate something i would go in and like i'd floss and take stuff out it was hard oh my god i don't miss those days to clean my retainer I've heard that there are issues with retainer cleaners and denture cleaners, that there's chemicals in them that could be harmful. So I use distilled white vinegar. Here it is. I pour some of this into a cup. I've been trying to do it like once a week. You know, you don't wanna do it too much because it can be harmful to your retainers. So yeah they say that distilled water is really good for your retainers and i believe it i honestly i don't soak my retainer in distilled water i just kind of use the faucet water yeah that's probably not the best but you know it's it's like another step you know that i haven't had issues with my retainer nothing they, it hasn't been warped it hasn't been ruined or you know it's been fine so it can't be too bad i pour distilled white vinegar into a cup about yay high and then I put some water in it until it gets like up to here and I soak my retainer in there and if you have any you know build up on your retainer this will take it off you know you may have to leave it in a little longer you know longer than 15 minutes 15 minutes will not get everything off um, you will have to leave it, you know, hours and hours, maybe overnight or maybe all day, and then you put on your retainer at night. Yeah, and then you just kind of brush it off. Mine, you know, it just, I put it under water after taking it out, and it pretty much came off. Whatever buildup I had, it just dissipated. You can brush it with your toothbrush, or you could get more of like a rougher toothbrush that'll scrub really, really well and scrub your retainer with that and even maybe put some toothpaste yeah to get 
all that excess stuff off, but you should definitely clean it. You don't want any bacteria in your mouth. You don't want your retainer to negatively affect your dental health. Do your research and see what works for you. Ask your orthodontist, my orthodontist, she just pretty much said, don't leave it in extreme heat or extreme temperatures. Just clean it and take it off softly and don't just pull it off your mouth. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I haven't had any issues, so yeah, it's gone over smoothly. Those are my retainer tips. I hope you enjoyed it.